Sudanese refugees in Ethiopia express that Ethiopian support in such tough time is an indication to the strong brotherhood and long-lived relation between the two nations. And Netanyahu reports. The people of Ethiopia and Sudan do have a strong bondage in history, culture, and the neighborhood stuff due to the fact that both the blessing and curse at each side breeds common good and bad consequences as well, respectively. The strong bondage between the two nations is a huge potential either to share the common good or to overcome the worsening situation together. And in these days, following the war between Sudanese army and rapid support force, Sudanese preference of Ethiopia as a place to stay sheltered is a manifestation of such a historic and holistic bondage. The relation between Ethiopia and Sudan was good as we heard it in our personal experience in these days at Ethiopia magnifies and confirms what we heard. يعني السودان ووزة القدم كان مسمى بعرض الحبشة تمام يعني ناس معشرين لنا ناس ألفين ناس مصاهرين مننا Sudan has been known as land of Habesha and we are glad for our present experience in Ethiopia restores our long-standing strong relation Sudanese refugees also stated that Ethiopians living at the border town Metamayhons have ensured their brotherhood and humanistic nature in sharing what they have in such a tough time. Europeans are so welcoming and the hospitality is so interesting. Europeans are supporting us in supplying injera and macaroni. The information came from West Condor Zonal Administration revealed that over 40,000 refugees are sheltered in refugee camps in Metamayhans.